Yo, what's up guys? In today's video, we're playing episode two of randomizing in Ceramic Crucible, where I randomize until I finally lose a match. Last episode, we won all the games, which was pretty nice. So today we're just gonna keep on doing the same thing. But before we get into that, comment of the day does go to this guy, so shout out to you. Also do me a favor, go down and leave a comment down below for the YouTube algorithm. I'd really appreciate it. And of course, subscribe if you haven't already. That would also mean a lot to me, but let's get right into it. All right, so this actually looks like our best opponent uh, yet. We're against this guy who has half a million medallions. He ends up skipping Temple. Looks like he doesn't want to play that one. Ink Blood. I might actually have a chance here if I get something decent. Let me see. I get Bomb. I get this. Nah, you know, I'm not going to play that. If I don't get Farm, I don't want to play it. Let's see. Water Hazard. Give me something good. Okay. This is this is playable. Give me a give me a water map, please, or a water tower. Hmm. Ice. Okay. Let me see. Dartling wizard. I'm happy about that. Like that is playable. But yeah, let's see. Yeah, I'm not I'm not too happy with uh, with this strategy right here. But hopefully we can make it work. I don't know how good uh, our opponent here is. So yeah, we'll see. Maybe I shouldn't have spiked that, or should I? Anyway, let's uh, let's go for this right here. I forgot to take care of that one. You know, I'm just gonna do that. I'm not gonna give him the satisfaction of getting like the farm money. Could have anti-stalled that a bit better. That's kind of on me, but it's okay. Of course, he goes farm boat. It seems like he knows what he's doing, which is, is definitely not ideal. But let's go for this up here. And yeah, just dart eco, and then we'll go for a wizard, probably a couple wizards. Um, and then I feel like we're just gonna have to play this aggressive. Thing is, he's got a better strategy than me. So winning this will most likely be slightly difficult, but we'll see. Hopefully, I'm, I'm counting on people being bad and me just being able to outplay them on, on like pure skill based on, or like instead of the strategy. So we'll see, because it's Ceramic Crucible, but this guy, I don't know what he's playing Ceramic Crucible for. He has like 500k medallions. Why would he not be in like Moab Pit or something? Probably is a normal Moab Pit player who just wanted to play boost only. Which is also why I'm playing in CC today, because right now there are crap arenas out, so we might just get like better opponents. Um, because there's nobody else out playing like BFB Kali uh, or Moab Pit boost only. Those arenas are not even out right now. There's only like, I think there's Moab Pit free power-ups and then there's like Moab Pit uh, old school mode out and that's like the only thing he's playing pretty bad right now though he's he's not he's not farming like he's supposed to I, I don't know why he's playing like this there you go he goes for the farm but he could have gone it gone for like way earlier so I don't know he, he's playing weird let's see if he sends um, some black balloons it would be smart if he did it would also be annoying but it would definitely be smart there we go. We're not anti-stalling too hard, so I'm happy about that. Anyway, let's see here. Got four, 500 eco. That is pretty nice. I think uh, for yellows, I'll probably just go for Spolt down here on last. I, I feel like like a Spolt right here would, would probably be the play. We got a really good amount of eco, which I'm happy about. I can definitely go for like... Oh, now it goes for that, of course. I'd, I'd say, what what can we go for here? Let's go for that. We can probably get like 650 eco away before round 10. I definitely feel like that would be a possibility. Let's make sure we don't leak too many lives though. Let's get ready with this one, uh, just in case he decides to rush. Let's go ahead and just send a little bit of stuff here. We don't want to over send too much. I want to keep like a thousand on me. Because again, he is a CC player. It looks like... Okay, he has Wizard, but he also has decent... He has really good farms, which is not what I want. Okay, so he says hi. Let's go ahead and go for a Wizard ourselves here. Let's say hi back. Hmm, let's go for Lightning. There we go. We got our 650 Eco, which I'm, I'm happy about the Eco, but I have to be a little bit more careful right now. Let's go for Spolt. Might want to go for like two of these, honestly. We'll see. Let's go for a little bit of longer range on these. Make sure that's on strong, get a fireball on this. Just uh, make sure everything's all right. Hmm. So he keeps on farming here. Do I, I could go ahead and like send him a little bit of stuff. 
Let's try and push this to like 700. Not even gonna send too much, it's gonna send a little bit. And then I'm gonna go for this right here. Let's see, hopefully he doesn't all out me. If he does, I, I don't know, I might be decent with a boost. But he could send us a bait rush first, which I definitely don't want. And so he has those two right now. I think round 14, we'll go ahead and send him something. All right, let's go. Let's see how, how he handles this. He sells everything and he tower boosts. Okay, nice. Beautiful, beautiful. Okay, here I actually was scared that he was going to be decent. He might counter though, which is a thing. Let's go ahead and put those on strong. Just get ready, basically. I got my two trips, which are also going to help out quite a bit. Then, of course, we got enough defense here. Cool. Now, now he's built up all his farms again. Let's make him sell them one more. And yeah, now we're just doing good. We have 830 eco and we forced him to sell all his farms like twice. Oh, he didn't want to boost that. He did. He really didn't want to boost that. Let's go ahead and send him some more stuff here. Maybe he'll boost to this. And yeah, my yeah, he boosted. Nice. My eco is looking fantastic right now. I think we can definitely send him a mob next round. But we have to be a little bit... Uh, Careful ourselves here of a Moab. I would definitely need to boost one if you send one. Or maybe, it depends if he just sends a regular Moab, I could probably just go for the Summon World one. Let's go ahead and send him one. We want to Bloom Boost this item for sure. Let's go ahead and Bloom Boost. Did that a little bit early, but that's okay. Okay, so he sold and he boosted as well. Are we good to this? I feel like we should be, yeah. Yeah, it's looking a little scary, but we're fine. All right, so he boosted. That's his last boost. He doesn't have any more. Now we just all out. Now we counter with the all out. Yeah, now he goes for a farm. And here we go. I'm not even going to like send too much. I'm just going to... Just straight up, just all out. And he's dead to that. He doesn't have another boost. Yeah, we, we take a pretty uh, pretty safe one there. I will definitely take that. GG to Mr. XXH Anime. 69XX, <laughs> nice name. Let's say good game and move on. All right, so the thing is, I never really want to underestimate anyone here, but this guy looks pretty bad. He has a 39% win record. So I feel like, yeah, as long as we just get NG here, honestly, we should win this. So yeah, we're, we'll, we'll just start out uh, just straight up playing this. I'm gonna put this down here and then probably go for... After we can't, we're, we're going to anti-stall a bit, which is sad. I like how he gets down a spike as well. Now he gets down two spikes, okay. Interesting. Let's go ahead and go for a sentry gun. Why don't we? Just to start off with. And then he goes for the farm. He puts down all his spikes and goes for a farm. Yeah, we should easily be able to win this. Might even be able to win before round uh, round 13. Yeah, now he goes for a wizard. He anti-stalls and goes for a wizard. That's that's not good. And then he wastes all his spikes. That is, again, not good. So, yeah, we should, we should easily be able to beat a wizard here, I feel like. But the thing is, again, it's always scary playing against farms. Because they have the potential to just all out you whenever. Whereas eco players kind of don't. They, uh, and if an eco player is going to all out you, you'll know, you'll see it coming because they stop ecoing to save up money. A farmer can just sell everything and all out you in a second. And they're so unpredictable. That's like the biggest thing I'm fighting against. It's just the unpredictability. It doesn't really matter if I like win, lose. I mean, I'm going to probably win anyway, but it, it, it only matters that I like realize that they're probably going to just rush me at random weird times. And if I do, then I can defend. All right. So it's not looking too good for him right now. He ended up chasing a bit. I'm still fine here. We're good with our NG. Now he sends a couple red plumes. I'm not going to be worried about red plumes. Followed by space blues. That's going to do nothing. I mean, maybe he tries to get, get me to upgrade, but it's not It's not going to be enough. That's not going to cut it, buddy. I'm sorry to tell you. Let's keep on going. And of course, I can always go for an ace. If I, if I really need some assistance, I can just go for an ace and I'll be fine. All right, let's go for this now. There we go. Alright, beautiful. 
Let's see, four, 80 eco. Look, looking really good so far. I'll take it. I can probably go for like 550. I can't go for too much eco here because again, it's it's a little bit anti-stalled. So yeah, let's go for a nine inch nail. Put this on strong, I guess, just to help clean up a bit. There we go. And I think here, if he sends anything, let's go ahead and send him a couple to space balloons. We can go for a larger service area and we can always go for, uh, what's it called? We, we can always go for the two, three if needed. See, so you might just honestly bloom boost this. Yeah, or sorry. Why do I keep saying bloom boost when I mean tower boost? Oh, I didn't even mean to bloom boost at him. That was a misclick. Ah, whatever. His tower boost about to be over. Oh, never mind. He goes for that. Okay, fair enough. You know, I don't mind. You you go for an unnecessary amount of defense? Go for it. I'm not going to hold you back. Hell no. All right, let's stick with this right now. And wait until we can go for our balloon trap. Which we can in a little bit. We just need like two more Ikubu. So three minutes, 18 seconds in. Honestly, we can probably just win here. It's an all-out rush, I feel like. But of course, we have to be careful we don't get all out rushed ourselves. That would be a little uh, a little sad. Let's go ahead and sell that. Go for this now. No, just wait. Get a little bit of extra money here. I do want to save up a little bit before I start rushing him. But luckily, we have our balloon trap. And of course, I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna panic spawn down an ace if he all outs me. I'm gonna just panic place an ace. Or I could place honestly, nah. The boomerang might just be better. I feel like a boomerang here and then on the other hand might actually just be the way to go. All right, let's see here. I think round 14, we send like a semi big rush. This should maybe force a boost. Nice. Okay. I, I sent too small of a rush. He actually didn't need to boost that. So that's my bad. I shouldn't have sent that. But now he's rid of two boosts, which is again, really good for me. There we go. And now he sends me free money. I'll take it. Love to see it. I keep on selling my... Uh, the reason I'm selling all my um, sentries here is uh, so that I get a little bit of extra money. There we go. Let's go ahead and uh, send rush round number two. Send a single one of these, I feel like, and then follow it up with some pink balloons. He might just be dead here. <sighs> 16 lives. No way. I should have sent more. All right. Let's go ahead and continue. Sell these sentries. Keep rushing, collect our bloom trap. Please be good here. Is he actually chilling with a super monkey? No way. He's actually chilling to that. Okay, wow. Well done. <sighs> okay, how do I... What do I do against a Moab? If he sends me one. I could upgrade this, of course. Don't really want to. Honestly, I feel like this is where we just all out him. Although he might be fine with a boost, we'll see. If not, I can I can go for this, I guess. There we go. Let's just send a bunch of stuff. Doesn't doesn't look like he's gonna be sending me a Moab. Oh, he sends. Okay, this is what I mean by unpredictable. This is what I mean by unpredictable. They will just randomly send like region camo pinks all out like what are you gonna do against that right you, you need to you need to always expect some some bs but yeah we take another win let's move on to the next one all right so this time we're against samet mumku and he's like risking all his medallions it appears so let's see what we get for snowy castle if there's anything worth playing here mm, sub ice is decent uh nah i think i think we're gonna skip that one all right, so let's see next uh, one up. Randomized towers. Uh, not a fan of it. Village. Do I? I guess a slew village could work. Hmm. You know what? Let's try it. Let's just go for it and uh, let's see what happens here. Not a big fan of this map though. I'm really not. Okay, so he starts out with a ninja. He's anti stalling with a ninja. That's interesting. I think for us, we got to start with the ace here, of course. And yeah, then I just got to keep it, uh, keep it like this. And now he sells his ninja. What? And he rebuys it. What? Oh my God. Why would you sell it and rebuy it? What are you doing? 
I actually saw him sell his ninja and I was like, wait, is he using the ninja to anti stall and then place it elsewhere? Like, is bro actually smart? But nah, he's not. I was getting scared I was playing like an alt or like a smurf or something for a sec. Uh, that would be kind of scary. Let's go for rapid fire here. Yeah, he bloom boost on round three with reds. Thing is, I don't even have to worry about reds right now. Reds are going to be pretty easy to defend. I might go for glue or a heli, honestly. A heli could work um, in order to defend like pinks. I think I'll probably just go for glue. That makes more sense. Because the heli would be moving around too much. He's not sending me anything right now, though. We're, we're kind of just chilling. So, yeah, let's go. This is looking good. I'll take it. Let's see. 350. No, we're still all right. He's starting to chase a little bit here, which I'm not like, uh, I'm doing fine against these bloom booms. If he kept sending, maybe I would have just for been forced to upgrade. But the thing is, ninja's really bad early on. It's so expensive. And look, he can't even afford defense. Like, what is he going to do to green blooms? Honestly, we might be able to force a bloom boost here. <laughs> Again, I say bloom boost. I mean tower boost, but yeah, let's see if we can force a boost. Honestly, I might just boost this in order to rush him as well. Now he sends a bunch of greens. Am I good to that? Probably not. Let's go ahead and go for sharper darts and then just micro this a bit. Yeah, there we go. We're fine. I don't mind wasting the spikes here. That's okay. We're still doing okay right now, but we definitely need to be careful. So we got a boost out of him, which is really nice. Uh, honestly, you know what? I think I'll wait a little bit here before I eco even further. I'll save up a little bit of money uh, to rush with yellows. If we can force a second bloom boost, that would be really, really powerful. Okay, now he boosts. What is he going to boost at me? I feel like I just go for never miss here if needed. You're boosting greens. What? Buddy, what are you doing? What is that? Alright, let's just go for never miss, I guess. There you go. Whatever. Alright, let's go ahead and send him a bunch of yellows ourselves here. I don't even need to micro never miss. Honestly, you kind of just keep that a little bit away. Let's see. I feel like that's a boost. Yeah, for sure. Let's go for a corrosive glue here. And now we go ahead and send him a couple lets as well. Of course, we want to send them as early and quickly as possible. That's a, that's a given. All right, now I gotta go for my village. I don't wanna don't wanna take too many chances here. Let's go for the village here, and we should be hopefully we should be all right. I probably should have gone for the village first. Oh, he goes for a sniper. That's interesting. Honestly, I feel like I can probably do something here. His sniper's on first, not on strong, which is definitely a mistake. I don't know if he's good to that. Ah, seems like he defended just fine. Well done. I have to be careful now in case he tries to all out me. I would need to sell this as well as the glue. And go for an ODS and boost. He's not all outing me though. Which I'm surprised about. Alright, let's go ahead and just bloom boost this at him. Even with a sniper, that, that's not enough to defend. Yeah, that's a tower boost. He might honestly just be dead here. Yeah, e even with the boost, he's dead. Let's go. We take the win. Let's move on to our last game of the video. All right. We are against Iona Williamson here. Let's go ahead and randomize, see what we get. Ooh, super looks fun. Hmm, okay. Buccaneer, Buc Buccaneer Mortar Super here could actually be playable. This is like at first glance it looked a little weird, but it's actually a decent strategy. The super might come in handy if we go late. Buccaneer is definitely gonna be very good early on. Okay, so he skips to race track. Let's see what we get here. Buccaneer NG is not too bad. Farm. Okay, yes. First time I get farm in this series. I will go for it. Thank you very much. Um, yeah, let's go for it. Also, if you notice my losses, guys, you can also see because some people might wonder if, if like, what do I get? If I get a loss, do I just skip it? Like, no. As soon as I lose, the series will end. 
um so yeah but again i don't want to lose but this series could go on for like hours you know it could i could make like 20 episodes in a row without probably dying because it's it's, it's cc maybe i should have picked this up in moab pit that <laughs> that would be more fun all right let's see it goes for that okay what do we do here do we let's go ahead and just send him some space balloons here he goes for the farm at least now that we have farm that this means we have rushing potential okay i don't i don't like buccaneer on this map but it's not bad either. So it's like, it's like, okay. And of course, right down here, we can always just go for an NG. Like, that is that is going to be beautiful as well. If I need to, I'll probably just go for a Buccaneer mostly. And then, like, if, if he all outs me, I'll go for, like, a Bomb or something up at the top. Uh, we'll, we'll figure something out. It's not going to be too bad. Anyway, let's see. We can go for the farm here. We can greed for sure. Thing is, I can greed, but he can't. If he greets, he loses half his lives. So yeah, you're gonna need to go for a lightning, buddy. Just gonna keep sending him just enough uh, until he goes for the lightning. There we go. There's no need to oversend here for me either. Like I, I could send him a ton, but there, there's just like no reason to do that. Oh yeah, I keep forgetting I have a fourth spot. It's so weird using a fourth tower. I gotta get used to that. Well, I don't. I don't want to get used to that. It's so, it's so cancerous, but still i feel like if you get a fourth tower both people should at least get the same fourth like that that would be nice but but people don't like they're they're just random what we get but if i get the first fourth tower like let's say the first tower or fourth is a farm for me it should also be like the same for him but what if he like goes farm during his strategy it's kind of hard to do but yeah sometimes a game can just be be determined by who has the better fourth that's how bonanza works bonanza is just it's rock, paper, scissors, because you're both going to go the same strategy. Whoever gets the better stall tower, like fourth tower, is just going to win. Like, it, it, there's zero skill in it. Uh, that's what annoys me about the game. Uh, let's go ahead and send him a bunch of black balloons right now. And yeah, we can just farm on for days here. This is this is beautiful, bro. We we can really just farm. And of course, we got a bomb. So if you like just randomly bloom boost freaking yellows at me, I don't know. Then we'll just go for a bomb. Or, or an NG could work too. Ooh, I was just about to send him some region whites. He goes for a second lightning. This is also what I don't get. You don't need to go for that second lightning. Look at how much I'm out farming you. Just already, because you're over defending so much. And he's not sending me anything either. He's not. He hasn't even forced faster shooting. It's so sad. Uh, anyway, let's uh, make sure we farm down here as well. Honestly, this is looking like a freaking round 10 BIA, but I can probably stall out him. Like, I'm going to have so much money, I can, we can... We can be so aggressive. Like, whenever we get farm, it's just fun. I will legit just have fun every single time. All right. Let's wait. Go for... Uh, we probably go for bomb. Let's go for, like, up here. On close. I don't want it too far away, but at the same time, it's fine. All right. Let's go for another buccaneer now. Can't really send him anything right now. It's slightly annoying. See, I want to go for a farm up here. But this farm is sometimes a little bit annoying to fit. There we go. See, honestly, he could all out me around 13. Mm, are you going to all out me? Let's see. I'm, I'm waiting for it. I'm kind of expecting it, like the slow farm cells, you know? Like, we, we've all seen an all out before. So let's see. Is he going to do anything? No. Okay. Could I force a boost here, potentially? Mm, maybe. Let's go ahead and just send him whatever I have on hand right now. I get a lot more money from... Yeah, there we go. Alright, nice. Awesome. Okay, let's see. We got the Republic here. So we're up a Republic and a whole plantation. Our farms are really, really amazing. Let's see. If, if, if you're smart, just go for the counter. Just go for an all-out. Kind of getting a little nervous here. Is he going to all out me or not? Okay, I guess we... We, we can, we can like, go ahead and send this. There we go. That's another boost. That's two boosts down. And he still has a farm as well. Goes for another wizard. Didn't really need that. You were fine with a boost, but... That's okay. I think we wait until his last boost returns, and then we just slowly just beat him. Let's also go for that thing. Go for a cluster too. Just gonna make sure we're all good here. 
Right, his last boost should return in a bit. I can probably send a Moa followed by some things up behind. I think that's the easiest way to like force anything. Hmm. Honestly, I might just go for factory though. Yeah, let's go for it. We could have gone for this way earlier if I wasn't so aggressive, but it's all right. I'm doing really good. He might think I'm just all outing him. Maybe he hasn't seen my factory. I should have hidden this better. Let's hide that up there instead. There you go. Is he sending... Is he not even going to send me a Moab or anything? Come on, dude. Why not? So boring. Oh, he blue boosts. Hey, let's go. I'm so proud of you, dude. Nice. Good job. Awesome. At least he did something, you know? Took some initiative. Well, that's nice. Let's go ahead and send him a Moab. See, he probably just... I don't know. He, I probably won't die to this, but... He'll probably die pretty soon. I don't even think I got a Bloom Boost. I want to, like, Bloom Boost just a big counter afterwards. I really want to know what his other two towers are. Like, he has so many towers. There we go. We forced the boost. The thing is, all I got to do is send regions. And, and it'll scare him. Like, look, he overdefends so much. Let's wait till... 6 minutes and 38 before this uh, BFB comes out. I don't know how long the Phoenix lasts. I think it lasts for, like, 20 seconds. Maybe this is a bit too early, actually. Right, let's Bloom boost this now. Let's send him another one up behind. So he, he could go ahead and just be... Decide to be very aggressive right now. I don't know. Let's see. Are you going to do anything, buddy? Oh, no. Nah. He might just... Yeah, he's just going to be dead to this. He's got drained throughout the entire game, and now he has, like, no money. So yeah, this is just how you like slowly choke somebody to death, basically. <laughs> it's, it sounds brutal, but like in, in BT Battles terms, this is how you just make people like die slowly. So yeah, we end up taking a, another win here. Let's go, GG. And that is going to be it for the episode. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you in the next one.